Byron Saxton, this man is a true testament to selfishness. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Weighing in at 201 pounds, Tommaso Ciampa! Yeah, just ask Johnny Gargano how dangerous Tommaso Ciampa is. His former best friend, former tag team partner, and Ciampa willingly stabbed him in the back. Ciampa knows what it takes to succeed and reach the pinnacle. The years spent learning and excelling on the independent scene. Champa comes from a pedigree like none other. Tommaso Ciampa knows exactly what he's doing. He's one of the most calculated superstars in the game. The WWE Universe doesn't like him because he turned the mirror on them. We're all capable of being what Tommaso Ciampa is. Thank goodness we're all not. <laughs> Feel the power! And his opponent from Parks Unknown. Weighing in at 275 pounds, the Ultimate Warrior. He's held multiple championships, has won so many main events. To be totally honest, I could sit and listen to Warrior pontificate for hours, even though I haven't understood a word he's uttered in years. It's okay, the Ultimate Warrior sounds cool saying it anyway. You just made it uncool. Congratulations. You ruined my childhood. Champa comes to the ring with a grim purpose, ready to pull out all the stops in order to bulldoze his way to the win. He's got one eye on this match, and the other looking past it into the future. Champa never lets anything stand in his way for long. His ability to obliterate any obstacle makes him a scary opponent. And look at the force of nature across from him. From parts unknown, the ultimate warrior is a scary and intimidating figure just inviting this combat. Come on into the... Oh, look at this power. Super power slam. His shoulders are down. One, two, just after two. He got close there. It could be do or die time. How do you counter the incredible aggression that Tommaso Ciampa fights with? You have to find a way to turn it back against him because you're never going to match it. Taunt Ciampa, dodges attacks, do anything you can to control the tempo and frustrate him. The less control Champa has, the less effective his range. Oh, measured elbow drop. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Elbow drop right on point. He's looking a little off balance. Yeah. Champa showing instinct. Look at this, going counter for counter. He gets out of the way. Champa is in some serious trouble. Champa looking a little frustrated there. Not being able to take control of the tempo at this moment.
bounced into the corner. right off your face. Boom! Boot! Nice. Such unbelievable intensity from the Warrior. Champion's resiliency is being tested here. Power slam. He's in a little bit of trouble now. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. Spaceship with rocket fuel because the warrior is on the move. And it stands the power of the ultimate warrior. Perhaps the Blackhearts final beat. What in the world? I'm not sure Champa's all there right now. I think he kicked out purely on instinct. The unmatched power of the ultimate warrior could not get the win. You have to wonder what it will take to finally end this. And that's what we call the tree of woe position, folks. So Champa needs to figure out a solution. He may get the three count right here. I think so. Two. Almost ended it there. Getting that shoulder up now is huge. Into the corner he goes. A perfectly placed target. The black card with a counter. Great reversal. From a Shoulders down for the win. One, two, three. And he sneaks out the win. Got his opponent by surprise. These guys feel no love for each other. Here's another look. This was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. An absolute statement by the victor here tonight. What a steamroller.